Hey everyone, it's Cameron Garrett um, with Making Faces and Tutus. Hope you're doing well. I'm gonna do the Ninja Turtle. I had a, I've had a lot of requests for it. It's a one stroke design. Um, it's really fun to do and it makes it look really impressive. So we're going to start with a number 12 tag, three quarter brush, and I'm using tag snake. I paint with this one a lot. It's probably one of my all time favorites. And I'm going to wet the brush and load the one stroke with just a little bit of the black. Back and forth. Hope you guys are doing well. It's been a little while. But I've been busy with kids in the summer. We're going to start I'm just going to kind of make some little marks to show you. We're going to make a moon shape. And just kind of blend the yellow down with your finger. There you go. And then I'm gonna go right above the eyebrow. Make sure you have enough paint loaded on your brush. And I'm going to draw the little loops above the mask. And bring it all the way around. And don't worry if it's not perfect, you can go back over it. Make it look nice and crisp. Sorry, loading again. Back and forth. I'm going to start on this side. Up and over that eyebrow. Bring it around. Pull it in. I'm going to leave room for the nose too. Don't be afraid to go back over it. Do not hurt. I'm going to fix this right here. Okay, so that's the start of this design. It looks kind of crazy, but the line work will fix it. And we are going to use a pouncer sponge. I'm going to spray it and load some Fab Emerald Green onto my sponge. And this is a show off spotty art giraffe print stencil, but um, I think there's a BAM that's really similar. I'm just gonna place it right in the middle. And we're gonna stencil like that. I'm also gonna do some stenciling on the bottom part right here. in right here. And there we go. And I'm gonna take another three quarter brush and I usually use either Tag Dragon to for the um, red or orange mask or I use, this is a new custom um, one stroke called Night Sky and it's available at the Face Paint Shop and that's www.facepaintshop.com and it's um, tag pearl light blue, pearl dark blue, regular dark blue, and black. I love this one too. 
we're going to use um, dragon and load back and forth. And now we're going to make the mask shape that goes around. I just kind of pick the inside of my brush and fill it in, or you can just dab with your finger. And it makes it look nice and blended. Okay. Bring it around and up over the nose to connect it. Just kind of blend with a clean finger. While the paint is still damp. There we go. And you can add the tie. Right here we're gonna make a little circle. With our brush. We need to reload. I'm going to pull out, down, and twist for the first one. And for the second one, there we go. So there's the start of our mask. Actually, we're almost finished. That easy. Now I'm, I'm going back to the original snake. And I'm going to add the nose. And for the nose, actually, you might want to switch to a smaller brush, but I'm going to try it with this one. Sometimes I use the half inch number eight flat brush. We're going to start on the outside of the nose. The black is on is pointing toward the outside. And we're just going to draw up and over where this mask is. Bring it around and give it a little loop like that. There you go. I can fix that. I can clean that up. And then flip the brush over. So now the black is on the bottom. And I'm going to go back across this way to kind of shade it in. And there we go. And I'm going to clean that up with a baby wipe if I can get it out it's stuck in here. There we go. I'm just going to clean up the edges a little bit. And when you're moving fast, don't worry about that stuff. No one really notices a little blip here or there. Okay, so if you have a couple extra minutes, um, I'll show you what you can add on to it, but this is a good, quick, fast version. Um, I'm going to load a number four. This is a Mark Reed round brush with some black. And I'm going to flick. And just kind of make these lines a little more crisp. I'm also going to draw an angry eyebrow. So we're going to flick 
and draw up and over your brow and bring it back down. I'm going to add some little hash marks, make them look fierce. Flick up and over the brow and bring it back in. Do I look mean yet? Okay, you can also add a little bit of black star blend. 